Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. Now, this is going to be a milestone video for our channel. On a rainy day in England, we're going to be achieving something monumental. We're going to be building the largest Forerunner diorama that I think I have ever seen. I'm very excited about it. And you can check out part one where I built my Phaeton gunship custom display stand so it can be levitating across the battlefield. This diorama will be based on Halo 4, Halo 5. It's not going to be accurate to one specific game. Part 2 today we will be building all of the structures, making the main diorama and having a focal point battle between the Didact and Fireteam Majestic. And then part 3 we're going to decorate it with more Forerunners than you have ever seen. This is the Domain's Forerunner diorama. We're going to start off as epic as possible with the UNSC Mammoth, the second signature series build in Megablox Halo, and also pretty dusty because it's been on my shelf for a long time. We're going to have the UNSC forces pushing towards the Forerunner forces, and the structure that they're going to be pushing towards is the Forerunner Cauldron Clash. This was always one of my favorite sets back in the day. Looks absolutely gorgeous and is equally dusty. Defending this is going to be the Didact and many of his forces and charging towards it will be the Master Chief with all of his. So we're going to have the Phaeton maybe just moving along here for now. We're going to layer a main base plate in the middle where all the action is happening. And then we've also got the UNSC Warthog and also the Mantis. Now, come to think of it, I might actually have the Warthog coming out of the back of the Mammoth. Riding onto the battlefield. Some base plates here, the rocky one in the corner there, and then Lava will be flowing off this structure, so we've got these lava base plates here. A couple of rocky structures. We're going to give the Mantis a couple of display bases just to give him extra support. This guy can fall over quite easily. Then we've got a little Forerunner armory bay and a Forerunner structure here. UNSC forces can have already pushed past that. A couple more lava base plates near the Cauldron Clash. A UNSC mongoose, maybe that's riding up the staircase. And we've got two Forerunner weapons crates, a few UNSC weapon crates too. I super glued a Spartan laser into here so it's kind of just peeking out. And then a UNSC ordnance pod. And then a little Forerunner sentinel just about here. That's the main basis of our diorama. It's already looking pretty epic. I'm very excited about this one. Now we're going to find the main focal point of this diorama. So it is my joy to unveil the Series 10 Halo Heroes Didact. This thing is absolutely gorgeous and he'll be one of the main focal points of today's diorama. He's going to be on the Cauldron Clash. He's protecting some ancient Forerunner secrets from the UNSC and Fireteam Majestic are going to try and take him out. This guy means business. So we're going to get one of the Halo 4 Marines. And these are really cool because their chest sort of flaps outwards like that. So. We can place the chest inside the Didact's hand, like he's hurtling the Marine through the air. His attention, however, is going to be on Fireteam Majestic. They're going to be coming up this ramp. This poor Marine is not having a good day, and trying to back him up will be his brothers. Two Marines on this mongoose here. We'll have one driving, and we'll have the sergeant on the back. Magnum in one hand, mongoose in the other, the sergeant will be doing his best to save his buddy. But the main fight lies with Fireteam Majestic. We've got Spartan Thorn, Spartan DeMarco, Spartan Grant, and Spartan Madsen. Sadly, Halo Heroes Hoya has eluded me so far, but I'll be getting him soon. But we've got all four of these trying to take out the Didact. Spartan Grant is going straight for the Didact, focusing fire. Spartan DeMarco, battle rifle in hand, and Spartan Madsen, will be coming up for sniper support around the back. Spartan Thorn with a four and a weapon, I guess he grabbed from one of the Prometheans. They're all gonna be shooting up the Didact, so we've got some of these muzzle flares for their weapons. Pop that on the DMR there, one on the battle rifle as well. This is probably going to turn into my favorite diorama ever. I absolutely love Halo 4 and 5's Prometheans. I don't care what anybody says, they were a fantastic addition. Halo 4's campaign was probably my favorite. 343 have made some mistakes, 
but I don't think they made them with the Prometheans. So this is the end of part two of my Halo Mega Bloks Forerunner diorama. This thing is gonna get out of control in part three, but we're going to display it with more Forerunners than your minds could possibly comprehend. Even all of these knights is just ridiculous. This was another Halo Mega Bloks diorama with the domain. Please check out part one where I show you how to build one of these display bases for your Phaeton and make sure to check out part three. I think it might be my most successful video. I'm very excited to show you guys. But for now, Spartan Grant is signing off.